Welcome to Around the World Channel. Prince Harry reported to have landed in the UK ahead of Philip's funeral, CNN. London, CNN, Prince Harry has flown back to the United Kingdom from his home in the US on Sunday ahead of the Duke of Edinburgh's funeral, several British media outlets reported Monday. Tiger Woods congratulates Hideki Matsuyama on Masters victory. Win will impact the entire golf world Fox News. Tiger Woods was elated to see Hideki Matsuyama make history Sunday to become the first male golfer from Japan to win a major with a victory at the Masters. Fed Chair Jerome Powell tells 60 Minutes America is going back to work, CBS News. A broad economic recovery is suddenly gathering speed, calling millions of Americans back to work. That's the message tonight of Jerome Powell, the chair of the Federal Reserve. The Fed, as its KN. Biden faces pressure from Pelosi. Sanders over whether to double down on Obamacare or expand Medicare, the Washington Post. Sanders said in an interview that he is arguing for lowering the age of Medicare eligibility to 55 or 60 and expanding the program for seniors so it covers dental, vision and hearing care. StoryCon Derek Chauvin's defense is using these three arguments to try to get an acquittal in George Floyd's death, CNN. CNN, after two weeks of testimony and 35 witnesses. Minnesota prosecutors are nearing the end of their case against former Minneapolis police officer Derek Chauvin in the death of George Floyd. A.D. Semiconductor summit held at White House amid shortages, NPR. President Biden holds a semiconductor during remarks before signing an executive order on the economy at the White House on February 24. Apple's upcoming iPad Pro could be scarce due to next-gen display shortages, and gadget. Apple's next iPad Pro is still expected to arrive later this month, but one model could be hard to find when it goes on sale. Why big spending Biden can shrug off GOP warnings of inflation, Politico. We've averaged less than 2% inflation for more than the last 25 years, Powell told lawmakers recently. Inflation dynamics do change over time, but they don't change on a dime. The Biden White House Media Doctrine. Less can be more, Politico. Our communication strategy is based on innovation in the digital space, flooding the zone in regional and coalitions press, and effectively using traditional national media.